So some champagne bottles were opened, and it was uh, it was fun. So this is the night before I went camping. <laughs> so this is from me. So um, so I had to like say the. Teresa. This is Tadiasan. He he's the guy who. Happy birthday! Yeah, so that was that was the night before. Uh, let's just say, let's just say I didn't get a lot of sleep. <laughs> Let let's just say I didn't get a lot of sleep on Friday night. Much 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 much. Yeah, I got those much chan. Looking like a host. Um. So then after that, we went. Uh, I woke up at seven thirty in the morning to get picked up. Uh, we went and this is on the way. Hold on. This is on the way there, so it's like this kind of area. We went to like the Inaka. Dude, I, one thing I love about Tohoku, which is northern Japan, is that um, the leaves have already started turning red. In in near near um, Tokyo, the leaves are still completely green. It hasn't turned. It doesn't look like autumn at all. Yeah, fresh air, right? But the leaves in Tohoku have started turning yellow and red, and it looks like autumn, and I love that. <laughs> it's a Pippa Jam. I love drives because we can listen to music and sing. That's my driver singing. This is an auto song, if you didn't know it already. So we get to the camp, and then we start... Uh, putting up together the tent. So, uh, we actually had two tents. We actually had two tents, and uh, one was this big tent that we all kind of sat in, and one was another tent, and we put the two tents together so we have more room. It was actually really dope. So that's my friend Subaru, who you guys see that I always go camping with, and it's his tent. And this is kind of the area we went to. So we put two tents together and it ends up looking... So then we got the tent, we got the camp, a little bit of a campfire ready. And then... Uh, he's my friend. He's my friend from university. It was a good time with good friends. We all, that was all, that was all gin by the way that we just took a shot of. And people have put up their tents like next to the water and stuff, and it's really, really dope. There's some people that do sailing and stuff. And I remember the last time I slept in a tent? I do, and it was last night. Yeah, but it's really nice. Oh, really? <laughs> you did? Yeah, I just thought you'd know. I, I just thought I'd let you know, you know? It's basically the lake has this big shoreline where we were and you can just like put up a tent or, or set up camp like anywhere along the shoreline on this side. So the inside of the tent itself kind of looked like this. Let me try to show you guys. So this is, it started raining at this point. So we were inside, you can hear the rain pitter patting on, on the outside. We have like a little gas stove here to keep it warm on the inside. So it's actually really warm in here, it was really, really nice. And then we had some, this guy was making a hijo, and then we made some roast beef. It was really cozy, it was dope. Halloween? Oh my god. Gory pizza. Is that a can of spam? It is. I brought it. I brought it. I brought the can of Spam. We had some Spam with the curry that we had. It was so good. I love Spam. Oh! Oh, we also, uh, we made some uh, rice in a pot. Which was good. Peace, peace. <laughs> made some rice in a pot, which doesn't happen very often for me because I, we use rice cookers. Oh, speaking of Yudu Camp. I brought my Yudu Camp mug. So that was, that was dope. I brought my Yudu Camp mug to when we were Yudu Camping. <laughs> oh right, and then we made hot wine. 
We got hot wine over here on top of the stove. And then you can see we have like a bunch of lanterns. So it was like really, really nicely lit and everything. We had a bunch of food. It was a good time. It was a good time. Mold wine? Yeah, mold wine. In Japan, they call it hot wine. Just straight up like just hot wine. Yeah. <clears throat> So let me show you some of the actual pictures from the thing. So um, this is actually at night at like 10.45 p.m. It looks like, it looks really bright because the moon was like a full moon. Touching grass, yeah. So th these are the tents and here's the lake. Oh, and it's really, look how cozy this is. This is our tent and it's not next to the lake, but it's next to some trees. Um... Doesn't it look super duper cozy? Inside it was really warm. Were there a lot of bugs? No, it's like towards the... Uh, it's like a little bit getting colder, so a lot of the bugs aren't around. Which is nice. If it were summer, there would be bugs everywhere. Did you do any swimming? No, I didn't want it to die. So... Isn't this super cozy? I love that. But yeah, this was a mood. With, especially with the... Uh, with the clouds and everything, this was definitely a mood. And then the morning, we made chat's favorite. Sausages. Hold on, let me eat. We made sausages. So we basically sat in here, uh, we ate good food. We made like roast beef and curry and, and ahijo and, and stuff like that. And then um, we played some board games and went to sleep. And then in the morning, we made some sausage. We made some hot dogs for breakfast, which was dope. Ellis's sausages are the best. Oh, thank you, Sergey. Glizzy time. Yeah, so the, the hot dogs are really good. Let's see here. Oh yeah, this is all of us. I love Subaru. This guy's so funny. <laughs> Good friends, good friends. Good fr It was fun doing good camping with good company. <clears throat> this guy's busy like eating. Yeah, and this is in the morning. The next day, the weather was a little bit better. It actually cleared up by the afternoon, but we had to leave by then, which was unfortunate. Now you're making me hungry after a 14 hour shift. Yo, Eastward, get some food. Get some food, get some food. And this is all of us. It was a good time. Oh yeah, and we had to do one of these. Like we're like like it, it's like we're university students or something. We had to do a jumping photo. It's all of us. So after we checked out, we went to an onsen. So at the onsen, the like outside it was really pretty and you can see all like the leaves turning a different color and stuff. Nice Makima cosplay. Thank you. Thank you, Marcus. Welcome in, dude. There was a wind chime. It was it was super super peaceful. Loved it. Oh my god! If you ever come to Japan and you go to an onsen, most hot springs, most onsen will have this vending machine outside of the hot springs, like in the hallway, where it sells like milk and like coffee milk and and some other stuff and some other drinks and coffee milk. Oh my god. Coffee milk after coming out of the onsen is literally the best thing in the world. For that for that like 10 minute window, after you get out of the onsen, you, if you get a coffee milk, it'll literally be the best thing you've ever had in your life. Okay? It is a must. All right? I'm telling you how to, I'm telling you some onsen culture right now. If you come to Japan, you go to a hot spring, when you come out, you go straight to the vending machine and you get one of these bad boys, okay? We then got some soba, which was Dude, guys, do you know what this is? When the when the person when the waitress came over and gave us our food and then told me what this was, I I was a little taken aback, man. I'm a cannibal. This is this is sashimi for koi fish. This is a koi fish. So we got some soba and then I came back. So this photo was uh, along the lake when. Uh, when we were driving to the onsen. <laughs> the 
食べるそう俺もびっくりしたよネギ食べれるんだ Maybe you do a two point five core after gaining the power of that one You may be right I saw that when I woke up I should not have clicked on your story I get instantly hungry It happens you It happens Fucking the driver our driver name is Koki Just put on like Just put on, just put on young, uh, young and wild and free, which is super funny. That was fun, but I love, I love seeing this kind of stuff in the countryside. Just wide skies. That's honestly the best thing. When you're in Tokyo or the Greater Tokyo Metropolitan Area, excuse me.、Um, <clears throat> That、the worst thing is that you can barely see the sky. There's so many high buildings everywhere that the sky is, is really narrow. It's semi. But when you go out to the countryside, the sky is like suddenly really, really wide again. It's like the best part. Yeah, so this is right outside the onsen. This is kind of like the hallway leading into the onsen area. Outside the window, you can kind of see this. Super serene. The wind blowing the trees in the background and everything. So, my friend who drove me, he, he has a car that he inherited from his grandparents. And he's from Miyazaki Prefecture, which is like way southwest. He's from Miyazaki Prefecture, from the way, way, way southwest.、Um, and he drove that car all the way to Tokyo. And this car was handed to him from his grandparents, so it has a lot of mileage. So, he's had, so this, this、uh, car has a lot of mileage. So, he, he drove us in this car. And on the way,、um, his car hit 150,000 kilometers、uh, on this like dingy K、uh, small like box car. So he wanted me to take a video so he could send it to his mom. Because his, his mom like wanted to see when this car would hit this. So. <laughs> 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 okay! <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna report this to my mother. Yeah. I know, yeah, this is, this is the traffic on the way back. This is why our collab stream with Yoshi and Renipo was late today. But yeah, that was my weekend. That was my weekend. That was my weekend. So, good old traffic jam. Yeah, everyone trying to get back into the Tokyo metropolitan area. It's the place to be, the GTMA. All right. It's a really popular place to be. I'm telling you right now. So.